Good morning, Real Tubes. Happy Tuesday. Tuesday. It's early in the morning. Why is it I always have eye goobers when I do my videos? You think I de goober before I. Okay. My name is Gretchen. I am NYAZ Girl. I'm also um, Saturdays on Project Life Size and Tuesdays on Life Embracing. I'm a busy girl. Um, Red Artist asked me to fill in for the next couple weeks for Naomi. We've got some stuff going on. So here I am, and I'm excited to be here. This is quite an honor, and I thank you girls for inviting me. Um, this week's topic is stereotypes and stigmas. Um, that is something that has been a big part of what drives me. Not necessarily to prove others wrong, but just to maybe to show myself that, you know, all those things that have been said about me or all the, basically to break the mold. And, um, you know, big girls can't, you aren't athletic and big girls aren't this and that. They aren't smart. And you know what? I got my master's degree. I, um, I've done, I did a half marathon. I walked it, but I did it. And I have a, I have the medal to prove it. Um, I'm a black belt in Taekwondo. That was a huge, um, that was a huge accomplishment for me because I, I'd never done anything like that before and nobody in my classes was really like me in that, you know, the way that I'm not the skinny little twig that can kick, you know, over someone's head who's seven feet tall. Um, I can't kick that high. I can kick it high enough to beat your butt, but I can't kick that high. And that's been a big part of my personal journey lately is because I, I was getting to the point in my classes where I was just beating myself up because I've gained some weight over the last few months um, because of some issues and some bad choices. Um, and... You know, I feel my body not being able to do what it used to be able to do. And I found myself during class thinking, God, you know, he just thinks I'm a fat cow. He thinks I can't do this. He thinks I shouldn't be here. That guy thinks I shouldn't be a black belt. And I thought, all of a sudden, I was like, whoa, whoa up. Because I've been thinking a lot about the spiritual side of martial arts. And, you know, that's what matters. It doesn't matter how high I can kick. What matters is, am I right in my mind, and am I able to handle myself in any situation? Yeah, I really am. And, you know, somebody else's idea of a black belt may be this, you know, skinny person who can jump 12 feet in the air, but you know what? I'm pretty good. I'm a pretty good fighter. People usually don't want to fight me. I'm pretty aggressive. Um, I don't always win, but I always fight, and I think that's I'm my metaphor for life. You know, maybe I'm not the best at everything. You know, I can't be. But I'm a fighter. And I, I'm a good fighter. I think that's all that matters. And, you know, in my mind, stereotypes are meant to... Stereotypes and stigmas are meant to downgrade your work. Or you're, you're the full package, you know? You're just this, and you're just that, and you fit into this little box, and they can put you on a shelf. When really, we're so much more than that. And you know, it seems like it le it's when I let my own judgment seep in that those stereotypes are really painful. And then I think, well, I'm, you know what, I'm not going to even bother because I'm just this, or, uh, you know, I'll always be a chubby girl, so why bother? You know what? That's when it screws with my head. And when I perceive others to, to be putting those stereotypes on me, even when that's not confirmed. Um, those stereotypes be damned. I have had those periods in my life where I'm like, you know, I'm this, I'm that, I'm, I'm overweight, I'm over 30, <laughs> um, I shouldn't even try. You know, don't, don't let... Though, don't put yourself in a box. 
How can you fly when you put yourself in a box? How can you fly? Be you, love you, and you can't ask any more from yourself. Do the best you can at the things that mean something to you. Everything else doesn't even matter. Throw the box away. Throw it away. All right, have a great week. I'm, I'm excited to be with you, and peace.